bring you this fighter short in a book will be lost for you already. <laughs> no, he won't. <laughs> Strutting yourself before us, bragging about the holiday he's taking while we stick you in men's fences. Calm, sort of high end, even. What, his trip? No, his being able to save. All right, here he comes. Young man. Why, you sawed off son of a this and that. I'll teach you how to play tricks on me. Let the big strong man beat me. <laughs> <laughs> Now, Hank, just because things look dark for you is no reason for you to go without your bittle. No, I couldn't swallow. Then drink the milk. It's building. Oh, How are you, Hank? My butt saw you. Darned if it ain't good to see you. That goes double here, Hank. Well, well, well. Oh. Here, sure, I added no lines to your lovely face, Mrs. Simpson. Since when you've been calling me Mrs. Simpson? I used to be Ma to you. <laughs> well, I still like to call you Ma, but you know, after being away from here for four years, it kind of makes me fidget a little to be so familiar. When Pa and me get that away, we'll build a high fence around us and dry up. 
Sit you down, and I'll get you some stitches. Hey, now, don't go worrying about me, Ma. Uh, I'm just passing through. Passing through? Ain't you going to stop with us, Miss Bell? Not this trip, Hank. I'm on my way to Waco for a holiday. Well, I just finished a batch of fried cakes. I'll bet you stay long enough to munch some of them. You sure remember my weakness, don't you, Ma? <laughs> you know I never could pass none of them up. <laughs> no. Sit down, Buck, and make yourself at home. Yours, Hank? Yep. Them fiddles look kind of invalid like to me. What's the matter? Ain't you feeling good? Uh oh, plum well, physical, but tormented mental. How come, Hank? Crime's sort of getting beyond my control. You see, Buck, there's been a lot of mysterious robberies right here in my county. And I can't round up the gang. And while I don't want Ma to know it, folks is beginning to talk about recalling me in favor of my chief deputy, Walt Greger. Walt Greger? Get into the Buck, and maybe you'll tarry a while. Uh, Buck, I'll water your horse while you and Ma powwow a spell. Thanks, Hank. Sit down, Buck, and start it. Did Pa tell you of his troubles? No, Ma. What are Hank's troubles? Buck, I may be loco as a drunk engine, but I believe Pa's been framed out of office. He was kind of hinting something about that. Who do you think it is, Ma? Well, I ain't ever felt just right about this Walt Gregor. Walt Gregor? Never heard of him before. He came in here two years back. And since then, he's been sort of running things. Wish I could stick around here for a while, Ma, but darn it, I've been hanking for this holiday at Waco for years. Oh. Why Waco? Some girl down there? Oh, Ma, you know. You know that females don't interest me, right? Ah. <laughs> Mrs. Simpson, a Mexican gent, gave me this and asked me to give it to the sheriff. Thanks, son. I'll see that he gets it. A paw, something for you. Thanks. Senor Sheriff, I desire to report someone is disguising himself to be me. I am no longer bandito, but have reformed completely. I desire to swear I have committed no crime anywhere in past years. Yet, I am reputed to continuously hold up and rob many people. Please believe me most sincere. I am no longer bad man. If these crimes continue, I must come back and kill whoever is making me appear bandito. Signed, Pablo Escobar, alias the Juarez Kid. Well, I'll be a son of a gun. The Juarez Kid. Well, if he means that, you've been wasting a lot of time, Pa. Folks been blaming these crimes on the kid, Hank? I have. My failure to capture him has sort of riled the people. You mind if I read that letter? No. I thought this was a phony, but it's from the kid, all right. Do you know the kid? That's what I want to know. Yep. Met him in Pecos two years back. He helped me out in a shooting scrape. <laughs> He's a great guy, but he don't believe in working for his living. Well, Land the Goshen, tell us about him. Well, uh, he's a little fellow. Got a great sense of humor, and faster than a rattlesnake with a gun or a knife. But if he likes you, he'll go all the way.
old phantom yarn don't listen good to me. That fellow's in these rocks and he can't fly. Report that to Hank Simpson and we'll keep searching. Stopping with us on your way back, Bob. Thanks, Ma. I'm planning on that. Well, Hank, hope you find your pony bandit. So long. Hey, that Juarez kid's been on the rampage again. We chased him into Billings Canyon and lost him. Did you see him? Sure, darn near winged him. How big a fella is he? Oh, a fella about the size of this man here. I'll saddle up and we'll trail him. How big is this deputy sheriff you spoke about, Gregory? Pretty big, Buck. Well, bigger than you. I'll see you on the way back, Ma. I got your hunch, Buck, and I think you're right. Get your hands full of heaven, mister. Jake, get his iron. This is sick up or am I being checked? Get off that horse and walk forward. What brings you into this country? You're a stranger to me. Been calling on Mo and Hank Simpson. Recent? Just left them. You seen anything of a Mexican in your travels? No. Sorry, wrong on you, mister. <laughs> I'm darned if I am. What is it? We're after the war ass kid. Lost him and picked up this gent by mistake. Who are you? And what's your business? My name is Still, Buck Sawyer. Just stopped in on Hank and Ma Simpson. They're old friends of mine. Sorry, my men mistook you for a bandit. It's all right. find the war kid, Hank. Well, I have reason to believe the war ass kid's reformed. You're not going to find the war ass kid. You're going to find somebody putting their crimes on him. You think as you like, Simpson. I'm going to back trail and search for that grief.
Watson. I'd hate to queer any man that was trying to go straight, but don't think you fool me. I haven't forgot that affair in Pecos yet. Swanson? Pecos? What are you talking about? Quit stalling. If you're on the level, I'll forget it. But if you're still crooked, you better move on. Hank Simpson's been like a dad to me. I swear, I don't know what you're talking about. The Warriors kid put that trademark on you two years back in Pecos. Next time you feel tough, get drunk and forget it. The fellow who killed that man's getting away. I'll bring him back. Carry my father inside. And don't think I'm afraid to shoot. on the couch. If you get some water, we might save him. of me into the kitchen.
Give me my gun. I'll try and bring in the man who killed your father. You stay where you are. When our boys return from delivering the stock your partner paid for, they'll take care of you. I haven't any partner, and I didn't know that you sold any stock. Don't try to lie out of this. Your gang bought our stock, received a bill of sale, then they, they shipped the steers instead of rustling them. You came back here to rob us. Do you mind telling me who bought the stock? A Mexican company. Represented by a man named Escobar. Was this Escobar a little fellow? You know he was as big a man as you are. I wish you'd believe that I had nothing to do with killing your father. Barney! Barney! Come in here! Bring that man back! You didn't hear anyone else around the house, Ruth? A crash of glass woke me. When I reached Dad, this man was running toward his horse. Looks like your visitor had business in this neighborhood, Simpson. I'd as soon lose my faith in Jehovah as believe Buck or Crook. Well, get the boys to work. We'll have a talk with this Mexican beef buyer. He's the only one who knew the money was in the house. All right, but I think you're just wasting horsemeat. Ruthie, let Pa handle this. You do understand, don't you?
ejemplo. Mi mamá es coming. Un hombre. Sheriff. Don't know. You like? <laughs> sure, it's good. Huh. So, senor, you walk right into the house of the kid and make yourself at home, eh? Kid? What kid? Not the Juarez kid. Un momento. Don't get new, senor. You call fresh. I've begun right in your heart, and I seldom miss, almost never. Remember Pecos two years back, Escobar? Big Buck, you son of a pistola! <laughs> What's the matter? I detoured a bullet with my shoulder last night and lost a lot of blood. That. Oh, Mama, Abba, hot water, quick. You take this man. They happy this is plan to capture you for rewards. Oh, Mama, you always talk and say the wrong things. There is no reward for me. Silly baby. There is many rewards. Why else do you stay here and never be seen in the time? Oh, olvide eso. Ande, traiga el agua pronto, mamá. Ay, caramba. Caracoles, mire. It's very bad. Are you going to finish him, see? Sí? Ah, I'm going to save him. Then we are even for the favors. What they call in the American language, 50-50. Eso está muy malo. Fool, then I believe he trusts women. I'll go and ride and find him. You will be a grand fool and you go out in daytime. Ah, Mama. I mean it. Your deputy. I'm not supposed to be here. Mama. Bueno. Tenga mucho cuidado. Bueno, mamá,
cover the sheds. I'll check inside. Oh, what do you do here, eh? How are you, Sonora? Seen anything of a stranger in these parts? What is the matter with me? Always you come here expecting to find a stranger. Why so, eh? We're sure there's a killer loose in this country. We're not accusing you, we're just asking. You ain't accusing, eh? Three times you asked me this last week, and three times I say you are loco. All right, Chili, don't boil over. Atrevido. Cállese la boca, grosero. Faltaba una señora. I great if I ever saw it. And fresh mind. Say, hey, this is better than finding a killer. Where'd you get it? Oh, I have a little mind that gives magic on. That is how I live, sabe? Well, you should live like a queen if you got much of this stuff. wondered what you use for money. Now I savvy. It is not worth. I cannot let others know, or they steal everything. No one around here, Walt. Okay, I'll be right with you. Right. You know, I might be able to help you. I'll be seeing you. You killed my father, and I warn you, I'll even that score. I've been thinking over what happened that night, and I can understand how you feel. But I had no reason for harming your father. You've taken everything. Why have you come back? Because I don't want you to think I'm a killer. Fire! 
Barney, get that man. Put up your hands. Turn around. Ruth? You were wrong about the murderer. The gun you took away from that stranger was a 45 and fully loaded. And the gun that killed your father was a 38. Gregor knows of the goal, we should be moving on. If Gregor's the man who killed Hopkins, maybe we can trap him. But what has the killing of Hopkins to do with our goal? I don't know, Mr. Andrews. He told Mona that he'd be seeing her. If he buys the mine, he'll come back and steal his money. The same that I think he did with Hopkins. And you want... I should stay here and let him... Kill me with a pistol. Oh, no. No, no. Wait a minute. Sit down. Si, si. Tranquilice, mamá. I got that all figured out. But we can't do anything till he shows up. Then I'll explain my scheme. Don't worry about him killing you. Let me do the worry. Uh -huh. Take out of here, senora. Oh, maybe 30,000, maybe more. Pay them. No, <laughs> dollar. Oh, well, chances are there isn't much left. I just get in the high grade, the best grade. I'll take this place off your hands. And you, why, you can live like a queen in Mexico with many servants. How much you pay? 
Oh, well, what do you think it's worth? I take $30,000. $30,000? Well, where do you think I could get that much cash? I'll tell you what I'll do. I'll give you $7,500 cash and a certified check for $15,000. No lo sabe. No entiendo. I'll beat that. You give me a bill of sale and I'll agree that all I take out over that amount, I'll share with you. Okay? That I like. I am so happy to go to Mexico. Okay, I'll share all I, I take out over that amount. I sign papers that way. All right, you sign. Sign right here and it's a deal. Sign right here. Bueno. Senor and senorita, you are my prisoners. Be good enough to hold the hands up. made a big mistake to misjudge a very good friend of mine. No harm shall come to you. Only it is necessary you be what you Yankees call, uh, show me. So I will oblige. I will show you. Take his belt and tie the vaquero to the chair. I don't understand. Oh, you will be quite safe with me, senorita. Please. Andy. This is Mona Escobar, the lady who owns this land. Senor Sheriff, I am very honest woman. <laughs> Mona, you don't need to worry. The sheriff is only here to see the show and stop the crime in his county. But if your hunch is correct, it's going to save me a heap of worry. Well, Sheriff, if my hunch ain't correct, it's going to worry me a heap. <laughs> Hasn't the kid got back yet? Not yet. That's Gregor, but he's changed his clothes just like that big fella said he would. Sheriff, what does this mean? It means that Buck's playing a long chance to help me round up a killer. Buck. Come here. Ruthie, I want you to meet Buck Sawyer. Buck, make me known to your friend the sheriff. He's not meet me yet. <laughs> Hank, I want you to meet the war ass kid. And in spite of his past, he's aces now. I'm taking Buck's word for you, kid. But I noticed he made me give up my gun before he let me meet you. <laughs> He's one wise friend. <laughs> Why? The vaquero is coming. Lo vio? Si, lo he visto. Right in. Quick, everybody in the other room. And be very quiet. Well, come, then.
I'm not a son of a worm. This bullet is a 38 long. I guess you're right, kid. Mm. We shall soon find out. Look, Senor Sheriff. A 38 long. And being in the confidence of Sheriff Hank Simpson, I could work with more freedom. I guess that's all. Unless, if it would help any, I'd like to add I'm sorry. I know just how you feel, senor. I was once a bad boy, too. But now I work with a pig. I thought I'd never have to admit it, but I'm sorry. Well, you sure took a lot of convincing. <laughs> I got a good job as foreman waiting for me, but uh, I kind of like this neighborhood. I'll need a good foreman on my ranch. That reminds me. The kid left your man hog time, and I bet he's about tuckered out by now. Say, when do you leave for Waco, Buck? Waco? Say, why Waco? <laughs> oh, Mama, you can't remember that far back. Yes, I can. <laughs> the Catarrias. ¿Te crees que no tener yo mis romances cuando joven? Oh, mamá, forget all about love. Get me something to eat. I'm hungry. Mira al niño. 